Details of how much was donated to UK's political parties in the second week of the election campaign have been revealed. Findings show the country's Conservative Party has suffered compared to other parties. It's found it over time, yeah. growing and growing and growing. Yeah. 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 Amazing. And there is nothing but a growing list of problems for the Prime Minister too. On a day in which he wanted to focus on his sales pitch to Welsh voters, it was the state of his party's finances that took centre stage. According to figures compiled immediately after the D-Day decibel, Labour raised a whopping 75% of the total, equating to £4.4 million. Reform also outperformed the Tories with 742,000, compared with just 292,000 for the governing party. It means the Conservatives have earned less than a tenth of total donations since the campaign began. <laughs> Away from the farm shop visits, more problems for the Prime Minister at the Welsh Conservative Manifesto launch, where he struggled to turn the page on the growing allegations against Conservative candidates, betting on the date of the general election. Can you hold your hand on your heart and say you are currently not aware of any other Conservatives that you know who may have done the same, who may have placed a bet on the election? Uh, Darren, there's not much more I can add to what I said previously. There are multiple investigations that are currently happening. It's right that those investigations are allowed to proceed. They are independent. They are necessarily confidential, as you will appreciate. There's also a criminal investigation. And for the party faithful, divided opinions on a difficult campaign. The, the view on the door does not reflect what the national polls are saying. I think the Conservatives will do well in Wales, but as for the rest of the UK, I think we need a stronger campaign. For Labour also launching the Welsh Manifesto today, they can't believe their luck, with Keir Starmer in Scotland using the controversy to attack the Prime Minister. The Prime Minister is showing a total lack of leadership on this. Let's look at what actually happened. In relation to a general election, the instinct of these Tories, when the general election is called, is not how do we make this work for the country, but how do I make some money? The Lib Dems are also primarily trying to paint this as a problem for the Prime Minister. When things like this happen, you've got to stand up and, you know, yes, sometimes you have to apologise, admit the mistakes, uh, but then show that you've learned. And at the moment, he's not showing he's learned. God, this is you! Yeah. Yeah. Rishi Sunak has had another bad day compounding a campaign of bad days with little money, polls that won't shift and lots of unanswered questions. The final stretch of campaigning could be the most difficult yet. Darren McCaffrey, Sky News, Rill, North Wales.